Look at the camera. My name is Andrew Paris. I'm a senior at Everton High School. I'm a point guard and shooting guard. Yeah, yo, that's fine, yo. Okay, these players have literally known each other for about three or four minutes. Their coaches got them together and they warmed up. This is Caleb Lutz at the point. Number 20, Prince Griffin. Shots blocked. Jump shot number four in the corner. It was Jacob Williams. Number 53 in the post, that's William McGinley from Bloomsburg, Pennsylvania. This is Amir Elise from Williamsport, nice pass into the post. Okay, that was Elise inside that was fouled. shoot one shot on a shooting free throw. Uh, if it's a two shot foul, they're only gonna shoot one. Uh, if he's fouled and the basket's made, they're just gonna count the basket and not give any free throw. Uh, the players will substitute every six or seven minutes, depending on the clock. Lutz with a rebound. Pull up jumper, that was got to turn his back to me here. That was number 25 on the red team, Matthew Karras from Abington Heights, Pennsylvania. 
Nice spin move to the baseline. This is number 25, Jamil Yai from James Madison uh, in New York. Forty-four. Jacob Slaughter from East Lake in California was followed on the drive. He'll go to the line. In this game, we have players from Pennsylvania, California, New Jersey, New York, Ohio, Maryland. Uh, looking over our list here, we have players also from Virginia. Each of these teams will play three games today. Oh, nice pass inside. Jamil Yai from James Madison in New York. McClellan from West York. With the pass there for the layup. Jump shot on the wing for Red there was attempted by Jacob Slaughter from East Lake in California. Jacob Williams to Elise. Left handed move inside, misses. And number 20 on the red team is Griffin Price from Rock Top Academy in Pennsylvania. Nice block shot there by number 44, Jacob Slaughter. Amir Elise from Williamsport looking inside, pass is stolen, lets up the court. Picking up the loose ball there was Griffin Price from Rock Top Academy. Two straight baskets for him for the red team. Three on the wing. Believe that was number 25, Jamil ya Yai. He is from James Madison in New York. This is William McGinley on the line from Bloomsburg. His younger brother is also on the team. Okay, we have our first substitution of the game. The team that has possession when the sub is called will maintain possession. White ball on the far side. This is number 15. Louis Urissa. He was added onto the list from Berks Catholic in New York. Prince Griffin getting a little roughed up there. It's still gonna be red ball out of bounds. Nathan Tice on the wing from Belfont. 
Justin Rosada was up at the top from Elizabeth in, in New Jersey. Number 15, Adam McGinley is also on the court for the red team for the first time from Bloomsburg. Number 13 for the white team was Cameron Sell from Mannheim. It's Prince Griffin going to the basket again. A couple Offensive rebounds here. Kick out for a three. Eighteen got that rebound. Jaco Jaconi Smith from Dr. Henry Wise in Maryland. Prince a little bit off. Ooh, good look inside for Amir Elise from Williamsport. Again, these players haven't played together, they haven't practiced together, so we're gonna see things like that. Justin Rosada drives, shot was blocked. Prince Griffin, Rock Top Academy. John Slaughter from Williamsport drives to the basket. He was fouled. Ray John's a senior. Kick ahead to number 21, Jasiri Williams from Springfield, Ohio. Long drive to get here to Sealands Grove today. That shot was Adam McGinley from Bloomsburg. Number 15 is Louis Usira from Berks Catholic that made that shot. I believe that was Elise, uh, Amir Elise who made the pass to him. He's going to finish. Oh, missed the free throw. Rebound by red number 22, Nathan Tice from Belfont. Prince Griffin drive. And Griffin was fouled. He'll go to the line to shoot one. and makes the free throw. Three point shot on that far side didn't get that number. I'll keep my eye on you and I'll tell you who that was here in a second. Three-point basket was made by number 13, Cameron Sell from Mannheim. And I think he just made another one from the corner.
Rajon. That was Rajon Slaughter that drove to the basket. It'll be red ball. Jacob Slaughter from California. Six foot four lists his position as shooting guard and small forward. This is number four for the white team. Louis Usira from Berks Catholic. Three point basket over there. on the white team with a drive. That was Alex McClellan from West York. Number 13 on the drive for white, Cameron Sell from Mannheim Township. I'm sorry, Mannheim Central. Sorry, Mannheim Central people watching. Matthew Karras from Abington Heights with a shot. With the ball, Adam McKinley, McGinley from Bloomsburg. Caleb Lutz from Smithport. Defense kicked the ball, be red ball on the side. there in transition. Number 13, Cameron Sell will go to the line. Alex McClellan from West York with a nice pass to him on the wing there. Looking to set his teammates up. Cameron Sell makes the free throw from Mannheim Central. Adam McGinley from Bloomsburg with a shot. with the steal. Jacob Williams from Midview in Ohio. Another long drive. 53 is William McGinley inside. He's listed as a six foot one center from Bloomsburg. Sorry, they were taking the open mic on the floor and banging it on the uh, chair. So I took my headset off and I didn't see who made that last basket for White. Yep. 
All right, that was number 25 for the red team, Matthew Karras from Abington Heights. Lutz, the smallest guy on the floor in there with the rebound. Number 25, Matthew Karras from Abington Heights. Lutz with the turnaround. That's number 44, Jacob Slaughter from California. East Lake in California. And a little right-handed scoop shot. I believe that was number 13, Cameron Sell from Mannheim Central. White ball after the substitutions are made. Amir Elise from Williamsport. To number four, Louis Usura from Burks Catholic. He was fouled on the drive. He's going to shoot one. Number 20, taking it hard to the glass. Alex McClellan from West York, District 3. Rajon Slaughter, shots blocked. Elise bringing it up. And Red's going back. Prince Griffin misses the layup. Oh, nice bat away on defense there by Nathan Tice from Belfont. Lutz takes the ball to the middle of the court, kicks left side. Prince Griffin, he makes that jump shot. Rock Top Academy, Prince Griffin. Number four, Jacob Williams with a shot. Elise to Jacob Williams. Williams is from Midview, Ohio. fouled again. This is probably the third or fourth time he's been to the line. Oh. Actually violated on the shot there. He went across before it hit the uh, hit the rim. The kick ball there. Number 21 on the white team, Jasiri Williams from Springfield, Ohio. And after the missed shot and the fight inside, Jacob Williams is going to the line from Midview, Ohio. Griffin goes to the basket. A little tussle there for the ball. You 
Sierra. Jacoby. Number 14 was Rajon Slaughter from Williamsport. Prince Griffin with a outside shot. Asking the referee if he was fouled. Amir Elise went for the basket. Caleb Lutz looking inside. Ball's knocked away. Head to number 11 on the white tight. Amir Elise. Number four gets the rebound. Passes it to Jacoby Smith from Dr. Henry Wise in Maryland. Jacoby Williams made a nice tap pass there to his teammate for the easy layout. Griffin Prince kicks out, nobody there. Lutz runs it down before the half court line. Back to Prince, Prince Griffin. Substitution okay, another substitution period. This is the last period. I can't see the clock from where we're sitting. So one clock running for the gym. Cameron Sell. Nice inside pass. 21 for the white team. Just Siri Williams was fouled. Listed at 6-2 from Springfield, Ohio. Adam McGinley from Bloomsburg. Nice drive to the basket by, I believe that's number 13, Cameron Sell. Mannheim Central makes the free throw. That's Rajon Slaughter from Williamsport making that shot. He's a senior. Nice shot over there. I think that's. Siri Williams. 25 on the drive, lefty. Jamil Yahia from Madison, New York. James Madison in New York. This is Jacob Slaughter. He'll go to the line. He is from East Lake in California.
number 21, Jasiri Williams. He's played well this substitution period. Listed at 6'2 from Springfield, Ohio. There he is again. Ooh. Ball got knocked away. Might have been a foul there. Can't blame our uh, referees for missing that one. They're on their about their seventh or eighth game today. We finished at Keene Camp this morning. There he is again. Just Siri Williams. To the line. And makes the free throw. Number 25 again for the red team. He made that one. He knew he wanted the ball back after he missed the other shot. He was calling for it. That's Matthew Kiris from Abington Heights. Bounce on the ball there. Adam McGinley from Bloomsburg. Ball coming back the other way quickly. Kick over. That's uh, Sell from Mannheim Center. He was looking in the corner for a teammate there, and Red knocked the ball away. there to Siri Williams 6-2 Springfield Ohio This is Justin Rosada with the ball, drives to the basket. Rebound by number 20, Alex McClellan from West York. Again, knocked away by the defense. He was looking for number 18, Jacoby Smith from Dr. Henry Wise in Maryland. Nice look inside on the inbound pass there. Jacob Williams got open, cutting back door there. It's Alex McClellan from West York. Caleb Lutz over to Prince Griffin. Drives to the right. Nice little scoop shot in the lane. Prince Griffin is from Rock Top Academy in Pennsylvania. <laughs> Prince Griffin fouled on the play there. He'll go to the line. the free throw. <laughs> Foul in the lane. Ball will be out of bounds underneath the basket. Mira 
Ruse from the corner. There's Lutz again hustling after the rebound. Long three out there. Kim catches number. That might be Isaiah Ennis from uh, Girard College. Nope, that last three-point basket was Nathan Tice, actually, from Belfont. Nathan Tice from Belfont. Rosada banks it in. Justin Rosada, Elizabeth, New Jersey, five foot nine, senior. List point guard and shooting guards as his primary positions. Shot and he follows up his own miss with a rebound. Alex McClellan from West York. Lutz in the lane, foul from behind. Bucket's good. And the free throw's good. Number 18 for the white team, Jacoby Smith, Dr. Henry Wise in Maryland. Lutz to Rosada, he pulls up. Amir Elise, kick in the corner. Elise with the rebound. Good move to get open there by Cameron Selly. Step back a couple steps to give uh, Elise a passing angle to give him the ball. He's uh, Sell is from Mannheim Central. That's number 53, William McKinley inside from Bloomsburg. Again, he and his brother are both on the same team. Drive by number 20 on white, Alex McClellan from West York. Prince Griffin with the ball. Turns it over. Amir Elise to the basket. There's Elise coming up. Amir and his team were at uh, the boys' team camp last weekend. It's fun to watch him play. He never stops. And one thing I'll say about watching him play all last weekend, uh, there he shot the ball himself and was fouled. He's looking to set his teammates up. delay here as we uh, get the right people on the court. Um, we don't have a halftime. We just keep a running clock going and uh, substitute. ball on the side. It's just Siri Williams. Rather big complex here if you've never been to this complex. 
you have four courts with a 200 meter track around it. So sometimes the ball will go down four courts, so it takes us a few minutes to retrieve it. Jacob Williams to the line. Rajon Slaughter with the ball. I think that was Cameron Sell there in the corner. Probably be wrong because it looks like it was Alex McClellan. And it was. Adam McGinley went up in the air there, lost the ball. Alex McClellan looks inside to Jasiri Williams. Off his hand would be a red ball. Red team hustling back there, knocks the ball away. It's number 30, Isaiah Ennis from Girard College. He said he was a small forward looking strong on the block there. Adam McKinley from Bloomsburg. Rajon Slaughter to Prince Griffin. Slaughter, Adam McKinley going back door there. Adam McKinley, a sophomore from Bloomsburg. Wow, nice move. Alex McClellan from West York. John Slaughter attempt in the paint. Alex McClendon from West York. Alex is a senior, 6-1. Pulls up for three. Good defense there. Playing defense there is Jacob Williams from Midville, Ohio, a six foot junior. Alex McClellan. Ray John Slaughter looking for somebody on that left side. Again, these guys haven't played with each other only a few minutes here. It's tough to get that chemistry together. Oh, pressing here. Adam McKinley from Bloomsburg. Griffin, Rock Top Academy in the lane. That's good. All right, this first game is ended. We're going to grab a couple kids for our uh, uh, player of the game interview, and we will uh, be back with a girls game after that.
Dave from California. We got to bring over here and interview. Thank you. So the first thing I'm going to ask you is, how'd you get here from California? Oh, we'll see. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Do you are you related to to your cousin that plays on the on Williamsport? Are you related to him? No, I'm not related. To him. Okay. All right, I'm with uh, Jacob Slaughter. Jacob came all the way here from California. Jacob, tell us how you found out about the camp and how you got here from, uh, from California. Um, my dad got an email and it said you got invited to this camp, so I wanted to come and show my, show my skills. Okay. Um, tell us about the, uh, your game and, and what you see yourself as a player and how you uh, are working to get to the next level and play in college. Uh, I just want to get my team involved and make sure they uh, get going, and then I'm going to find my way to get my buckets, and then this, just working on my skills, staying in the gym 24-7, putting up shots, and learning how to drive, handle the ball. Now, as you're looking at college, do you have an idea of what you want to, to major in in college, uh, what you want to be when you grow up, as they say? Yeah. Um, I'm looking into computer programming and computer science. I'm really interested in tech and in science in general, and I also look at history because I'm a history buff. I like to just learn about everything. Well, just from my few seconds of talking with you here, you're a very bright uh, young man, and uh, I was glad that I uh, got, got a chance to watch you play, and I think we'll get to watch you play again later this afternoon. Yeah. So have a good next two games, and uh, good luck to you. Okay, thank you. Now, Alex is going to be a senior from West York, so you're not too far away. No, no. Um, Jacob, that we interviewed just a second ago, was all the way from California. Okay. Tell us why you came to, to Keystone Shootout today. Um, I came to Keystone because my mom got an email, and I just love to play. I play in a men's league with my summer team, so any chance that I can get on the court, I love to do it. Okay. Tell us about how you play, uh, how you fit in with your program at West York what you've accomplished as a player and, and what you hope to accomplish going into your next season. Um, I'm looking to be one of our higher scorers on the team while also being a uh, demonstrative leader. Um, last year we went to a tournament and I was a tournament MVP and this year we hope to make a farther run into the playoffs. And, and District 3 is a tough district. It's one of the tougher districts in Pennsylvania. you got a lot of good, uh, good teams in there. Um, Tell us about your future. What are you planning on for, for college? What do you want to major in for any of the coaches that are out there? You know, that's part of their recruiting process. If you, they, they don't offer your major, you know, you, you want to major in certain things. What type of, uh, what type of career are you looking at? Um, I look to major in something towards business, like sports management or sports marketing. Um, uh, something like athletic director, somewhere around those terms. Just love to be around sports. Awesome. Well, thanks for visiting with us. Good luck to you in your next two games. Thanks for coming today.